guys, what's up? It's your girl Golden Jailene. Welcome back to my channel. Today's look is going to be another one palette eye tutorial. Today, ooh, today I'm using the Naked Palette by Urban Decay. This is the original Naked Palette and I really love how this look turned out as I say in all of these videos, but I, I really mean it when I say that. If you didn't know or if you didn't notice, I love gold, I love bronzes, I love coppers, and this was actually my very first expensive palette that I purchased with my own money and I just love every single color in this palette. <laughs> I just love every single color in this palette so much. So I have like a, I don't know, like a connection with this palette, <laughs> if you know what I mean. But anyway, if you'd like to see how I got this really simple bronzy look, just keep on watching. So you guys know that I normally like to start off with a matte white shade, but Unfortunately, this palette does not have a matte white. The shade right here called Virgin, you'd think it's a matte shade, but it's actually not. It's a satin. There's a lot of really, really tiny little shimmers in it. It's not like like this by any means, but it, it's just not matte enough for me. I'm actually just going to take powder and set my eyelids with that. So now for my transition shade, most people use Naked, but I feel like that's way too light for me, but it's also too dark to set my lids, so I'm gonna go with Buck, and I'm actually gonna mix it with Naked. Next, I'm just going to be taking Smog, and I'm gonna put that all over my lid. My brush is not wet, by the way. I don't feel the need to wet my eyeshadow brush when I use this palette. I feel like it's pigmented enough on its own. It's not full-on pigmented on like the first swipe of color. I mean, as you can see, this is less pigmented than that. But if I just do like two to three layers, see that's already getting closer to that. It is pigmented enough without having to wet the brush. Next I'm just going to go back into Buck and Naked and I'm going to blend that out a little bit more. And using the same brush that I used to apply Smug, I'm going to go into Dark Horse and I'm going to focus that like on the outer third almost the outer half of my eye. And now I'm gonna take a little bit of Naked, just Naked, and I'm gonna further blend that out. Now I'm gonna take my brush into Creep, and I'm just gonna Put the tiniest amount on my outer corner of my eye. And again, I'm going to take naked and just blend it out. Now I'm just going to take the color Virgin and I'm going to put that on my brow bone. And I'm going to take Sin and put it in my inner corner. And I'm also just going to take that blending brush with no additional product and blend those two colors together. I'm going to take some of this NYX Slide On Glide On eyeliner and this is in Glitzy Gold. And I'm just going to put that in my waterline, which is always a struggle. Ow! You can hear something in the background, by the way. That's my grandma talking on the phone. This is always the biggest struggle for me, putting on eyeliner in the waterline. Not winged eyeliner, but eyeliner in the waterline. Now I'm going to go in with the color Buck, and I'm just going to use the brush that this palette came with. And I'm going to apply this to my lower lash line. Now you can totally go ahead and just apply 
liquid eyeliner but I didn't want to do that today especially because I'm filming another video right after this one but I'm gonna go ahead and do my mascara off camera and I'll be right back okay guys that completes this look using the naked palette by urban decay stay tuned for my next looks using this palette thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye